You love Python. I know you love Python. Now, I love the mainframe, and the mainframe loves Python as well. So give me just a few minutes, and I'm going to explain why your love of Python will translate to your love of the mainframe as well. Here we go. Let's say you're a data scientist. As a data scientist, you care about more data and fast processing. Well, let's think about it. The mainframe today has 70% of the world's structured data, at least, on the system. So you have access to large amounts of very important data that run banking systems, insurance systems, the financial world. Using Python, the Python you're used to, current versions of Python, the most popular Python packages that you use for data science are available on the mainframe as well. So you can use your skill, your knowledge, and you can apply it to all of this data. And for fast, we have the Telem processor. The Telem processor allows you to load those models into the system and allow them to run alongside the existing processing. So your job, make sure fraud detection happens. Well, I can do that in line as part of the processing. I don't have to wait. I don't have to call out to some other system. It's in line processing. And I can do it as fast as a credit card swipe. So as a data scientist, I use all of my existing tools, all of my existing capability, and I get access and faster. Now let's turn to the next person, the SRE. When I think about SREs, you're using Python today. You're doing infrastructure as code with Python. It's the most common language when we're coming dealing with SRE environments so that I can manage systems effectively. Well, on the mainframe, you may think about Rex and JCL, but forget about that. You can use Python to do all of what you need to do on ZOS. You can ignore those languages and just build new things using Python. And if you have to, you can call existing Rex and JCL if you want to, or you can do it all in Python. Familiar, it has full capability to work with all of the existing ZOS systems so that you can configure your middleware, do all the automation necessary. And you get to take advantage of the existing hardware. So you can use things like the compression available on the system through Python. So you're not having to do something different or call something different. You have access to the hardware itself capabilities from your native Python. And now, when we think about this last use case, the CIO, what does CIOs care about? Money. What is it going to cost me to do this? Well, in the Z world, we have the zip processor. The zip processor is running alongside the general purpose processor. And with the zip, you don't pay monthly license charge. So you're getting to do all this additional processing without adding to your bill and your bottom line. So this makes all of this work efficient, easy, effective, and without costing anymore. So hopefully it's clear that you love Python and now you can love the mainframe with Python since the mainframe is what runs the world. Thanks for watching. If you like this video and would like to see more videos like this, just click like and subscribe.